Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. I am so excited for today's video because we are hitting the hard reset button today. If you guys watched my last vlog, which I'll link somewhere up at the top here, I mentioned how I've been really feeling like I need to get back into a good routine, just get back on track, and that's exactly what we're going to be doing today. I feel like I had such a busy, hectic week, so this is very much needed and I'm really excited to bring you guys along. My room and my bathroom are an atrocious mess. It's actually kind of embarrassing, so we definitely need to fix that. And overall, I just want to get myself organized for the weekend, for the week ahead. Today is Saturday, and I've actually had a very exciting morning. I picked up my wedding dress earlier, which was so much fun. I found my dress back in October, and it just arrived this week, so I was able to see it in person again and try it on for the first time since we ordered it, and it was so, so exciting. So that was a really fun way to start off my day. We got coffee afterwards, so I have my iced caramel macchiato ready to go, and I'm just ready to hit the ground running today. I also got my Sephora sale order in the mail, so I thought we could unbox that together. I did a big restock on a bunch of my hair care favorites, so I figured I'd share some of those products with you guys if you are also shopping the sale or if you just want to look for something new to try. So with all that being said, let's get to cleaning and take care of this situation because it's, it's pretty bad. I'm gonna take a little bit of a break from organizing. It already feels so much better in here. I can see my floor again. I can see my bathroom counter again. So I thought it was a great time to sit down and do our little Sephora haul together. So I have my box right here and I'm really excited to share with you guys what I decided to buy. So with my skincare, hair care, makeup products, I feel like I'm at this point now where I know the brands that I like, I know what products that I like to use, I know what works best for me. I kind of like to stick to the same brands and the same types of products. So that's exactly what this haul is. It's just a restock of some of my favorites that I've used and loved for years, as well as some additional products that I just found myself needing. First up from Olaplex, I got two products from them. I absolutely love Olaplex. I use their um, detox clarifying shampoo as well as their purple shampoo for my highlights and I really like their styling products. So the first thing I got was a restock of their number six bond smoother. And this is a really good leave-in product. I would say it's a combination between a leave-in conditioner and a styling cream. So what I like to do is on wet or damp hair, I'll just take a dime size amount of this and work it through the midsections to the ends of my hair before I blow dry it. And this is not only gonna smooth your hair, fight frizz, but it's also going to reduce your blow dry time as well. I've used this for such a long time now, and this bottle really does last a while, which is great. I was getting my hair cut and highlighted last week, and my hairdresser actually complimented me on how healthy my hair was, and I was honestly shocked when she said that because I do tend to use a decent amount of heat on my hair, whether it's blow drying, straightening, or curling it, I feel like I'm always using some sort of hot tool, so I really do think that this product has helped with that and has really like strengthened the ends of my hair. So if there's one product that you try out of all the things that I'm about to share with you, let it be this one. Next up from Olaplex, I also picked up their Volumizing Blow Dry Mist. And I think this product is relatively newer from them, so I'm excited to try this out. But I always use some sort of volumizing spray before I blow dry my hair. My hair is pretty fine, so it could use a little help in the volume department. I especially like that this is also a heat and humidity protector as well. So perfect for the upcoming summer months as well as any heat that you're gonna apply after using this. I think a product like this in combination with the number six leave-in is the perfect recipe for an at-home blowout. This next product is something that I have been wanting to purchase a full size of for so long. That is the Mizani 25 Miracle Milk. 
And this is another leave-in product, but it's a spray. So I like to use something like this as a detangler. So when I get out of the shower, I'll use my microfiber hair towel. I'll take that out and then before I brush through it or do anything else, I will add something like this. And there are so many benefits to this product. There's literally 25 things that this does to your hair just between moisturizing, strengthening, so many great things. I absolutely loved the little sample that I had, so I'm very excited to now have the full size. My other go-to brand when it comes to hair products is Moroccan oil. I love the traditional Moroccan oil treatment. I also use their hairspray, so I picked up a couple of products from them. So the first thing I got was a restock of the Moroccan oil treatment. And I really love that this comes in a light formula. Like I said, I have fine hair, so anything that's super thick and heavy will just kind of weigh down my hair and make it look greasy. But I have never had that problem with this product. So I always get the value size because it's a little bit bigger and it comes with this pump. A little bit goes a long way. So I just take a small pump in my hand when my hair is wet and then I'll just run that through the ends. I actually used it on my hair this morning before I blow dried. I don't know if you're able to tell, but this leaves your hair so silky smooth and so shiny. I would highly recommend this one as well. My last two products that I got are also from Moroccan Oil. The first one is their Perfect Defense Heat Protector. And like I said, I use a pretty decent amount of heat on my hair, so it's always important for me to have a product to protect my hair from those hot tools. And I really wanted to try this because it's a dry spray. And there's nothing worse than when you spray heat protectant and then your hair is wet, and then you have to wait for it to dry before you can actually use any heat on it. So I'm excited to try this as something a little bit different. And then the second one that I got is the dry texture spray. I always love using a product like this or a sea salt spray when I'm curling my hair. I feel like adding a little bit of extra texture makes the style hold a lot longer, especially if you're like me and your hair doesn't hold a curl well. Definitely try spraying a texture spray and see if that helps you. I've seen a big difference from using products like these, so I'm really excited to try this one. Those were all of the products that I got from the Sephora sale this year. I will have everything linked in the description box if you guys want to try anything out for yourself. But now that that is done, I think it's time to go throw in some laundry because my hamper is overflowing and I feel like we just need to get that done. I just sorted all of my laundry like you guys saw and I just threw in a load of whites. I'm gonna save the rest of the deep cleaning for tomorrow when I can do more of a proper Sunday reset and wipe everything down and dust and vacuum and all the things. But I feel like laundry always takes the longest. So if I can get a jump start on that, I try and do that if I can. So I'm gonna start off with that, but I did wanna share my favorite laundry detergent. Maybe that's weird, I don't know. The Method laundry detergent in the fresh air scent the blue one is my absolute favorite if you have sensitive skin this does not irritate my skin at all it smells really good and it's not an overpowering scent either which i love later now we had dinner and I just painted my nails I showed you guys in the last clip but I usually just do regular nail polish but I use a gel base and top coat and I find that it lasts so much longer it's the perfect at-home gel manicure and I just did OPI Thrill of Brazil today it's one of my favorite reds I would say between this and OPI's Let's Be Friends those are like my two go-to signature colors so that felt really good I am now sitting down with my tried and true day designer planner, just making my to-do list for the week, taking a look at everything I have going on. I always like doing that at some point during the weekend because it's just good to see ahead of time, plan some things out instead of trying to address it day by day during the week. finished with my little administrative planning session and I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. My last video was a full-blown night routine so if you guys are interested to see 
what the rest of my night is gonna look like, feel free to go watch that video. I am definitely feeling more organized and ready to take on the rest of my weekend and the week ahead. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to subscribe to stick around if you haven't already, and I'll talk to you all in my next video.